Yo, what up, YouTube? No, I didn't start FGO back up again. So before you comment down below, yo, bro, I thought that you quit FGO. I did. Uh, I did, but I wanted to talk about this because, well, there's a pity system in uh, in Fate Grand Order now, um, and there's a lot of people that are on some heavy, heavy doses of copium um, being like, bro, you know what? No, nah, man, this pity system ain't that bad. It's, it's, hey, you know what? It's better than USOs, brother. Hey, you know what? At least it's something. That's a whole lot. That's a whole lot of copium. That is some FGO levels of copium. So we're going to read into this. Uh, I am familiar with it. I've had a couple conversations with people about uh, the uh, the pity system and why I think that it's uh, that's bad. Um, and the fact that uh, <laughs> North America you're going to have to probably wait two years for this stuff because you know what? If you got this early, do you understand the amount of re that the JP players would give you? Because they would be like, wait, hold on. They're getting this six months earlier than us. We had to walk uphill both ways in the snow with no pity system. This is is actual bullshit. Uh, the North American team should never get, the North American version should never get this even a day before we get this. So literally North America is going to have to sit sideline while the JP version is going to get the pity system. It's much like watching your girlfriend get, uh, you know, railed by a Chad while you just sit around and watch and hope maybe, just maybe, he will decide that he'll give her give her back a little bit early because North America is is just NTR'd by JP. That's really what it is at the end of the day. So anyways, uh, let's scroll down first off. Those fluffy ears, bro, let's let's get it. Uh, so the FGO new pity system explained. So after three hundred and twenty nine summons without getting a five star, the 330th summon is guaranteed to be a be the five star character of the banner that you're pulling on. This pity count is not shared and is reset whenever the banner changes. Now, it's gross because there's no carryover. That means that you're spending 900 St. Quartz to get one. This doesn't carry over. It's just one. One and done. Yikes. It's important to mention every 10 pulls, you get a free one. That's why I said 900 St. Courts. Yes, I am aware. So it is technically 300 pulls uh, because every 10 you get an 11th one. Yes. Yes. But at the same time, people out here being like, you know what, bro? Man, that ain't that bad. Eh, 900 Saint Courts. Look, man, Fate Grand Order has never been known for their generosity when it comes to Saint Courts. Not like Grand Blue Fantasy, not like E7, not like a lot of other games. Somebody's gonna come in the comment section and be like, but Shogun, what about what about Genshin? I didn't say Genshin's pity system wasn't garbage. I didn't say that at all. So get that out of here. First off, if you have a pity system and your currency actually comes rather regularly, um, pity systems are not that bad, especially like if you have one that's like 330 pulls or 300 bull. Um, Epic seven has a very nice pity. As a matter of fact, you can get to pity very, very, very easily. Um, but this doesn't share a banner. So here's the other downside. There's a lot of rotating banners, right? Where you have your rate up servant and then you have another five star. And then the next day it changes. Well, guess what? That's a new banner. So you either sit down and you pity it in one day or get wrecked. Because as soon as that banner changes, your pity system, your pity is gone honestly i hate pity systems that are not um that don't carry over i think pity should always carry over 
um, I like when pay systems carry over because it allows somebody to work up to that, right? Maybe like take Epic Seven, for example, on Mystic Summons. You pity yourself up to a certain point and then you hold it. You, you hold on to it for dear life because you're like, you know what? I might not like this one. I like this one, but I don't like this one as much as maybe this one in the future, right? So this is... This is hot doo-doo. This is, this is not good. People who are saying, you know what, Shogun, but at least it's something. Bro, just put that mask on and huff, huff that copium. Um, because here's the other thing too, right? Maybe they decided that, uh, you know, pity in general uh, is a good way to get somebody who's right there on the cusp to continue to spend more money and with a rotating banner now your chances of getting that person to spend more to get to that 330 saint you know not saint courts but 330 poles uh 300 poles uh because you get this the uh extra one somebody in the comment section is gonna not even get to the point where i mentioned that and they're gonna be like shogun you know that there's 11 pulls now right you know that you get a free one ever blah 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 and i'd be like you know what i i don't care i literally do not care get out of my comment section but it's the it's the mental thing here and honestly i think that if this is the new year into what anaplex is doing because well for those of you who don't know anaplex is you know in charge of fgo now and uh i already got my feelings about that because let's hands up in the chat if you remember magia record north america and how well that went um i personally think that anaplex is a terrible company um, I think that they are very money driven. And I think that as soon as JP were to ever start to taper off, um, I think that they wouldn't think twice about literally pulling a Magia record on North America. And this is just the beginning of that trend in my opinion now for ages people have been like hey we actually want a real pity system um and now you've got it but you still have to wait for two years for it um i it blows my mind it blows my mind constantly how behind every other game every other game in the mobile gaming market that fate grand order is behind every every game that has any stain power you can log in from multiple accounts you or from multiple devices you tie it to an email it has a pity system it has you know all of these things ant invasion probably had a pity system they need to get with the times. They're literally a boomer that's just like, bruh, these kids, these these pony gotcha games are wrecking us. What do they have that we don't? Uh, literally everything else. A everything else, man. You know, it's World of Warcraft all over again. Yeah, Moo, it's arrogance. They're at the top. They are up here at the absolute top of the pile right and they look down upon all of the other people below them and they go ha ha peasants peasants you'll never be able to even you'll never even be able to have my table scraps and then genshin comes along and then pony musume game comes along and then all of these other games come along and when FGO doesn't have a new unit out, where are they? Where are they are in the chair? They're not near the top because nobody's paying for anything. They're never, they're not paying for anything. New unit comes out, bam, goes right back up to the top and then deflates because they don't they don't have anything. There's delays. There's 
giant dead gaps. There's all this other stuff while they focus on FGO Arcade. I wonder how that's been working out for him, actually, with, you know, the pandemic and um, and all of that stuff. I can't imagine that um, the FGO Arcade game is is doing doing really well compared to a potential mobile game or a PC port, you know? So they come out with they come out with the pity system. Now, some people are like, uh, you know, hey, maybe this is just their first iteration. Maybe they'll change it. Maybe they maybe they will, you know, they'll realize that it, this is garbage and then they'll fix it. No, because here's what's going to happen. It's going to come out and then they're going to go. Why are you complaining about this? You should, you should be grateful. You should be grateful that we even put this in the game. And then people are just going to accept it. They're just going to accept it. The other thing too, and this is a good point, Red Joker, it's very not friendly for new players. Now, here's one of the things is that for Fate Grand Order, um, you can beat pretty much everything with, with low, can, low rarity units. Um, you know, all of this other stuff. It's, it's really not super, super crazy hard. The, the combat's not super in depth. Anybody that tells you that, uh, FGO is the pinnacle of gameplay is, is lying. And, uh, they also may have never played another game in their entire life. Um, it's, it's really not that deep, but as a game ages, typically a game gets more and more generous to the point where it's overly generous. Um, if you were trying to catch up in grand blue fantasy right now, um, it's going to be really hard, but at the same time, grand blue fantasy understands that and they go, Hey, here's endless amounts of stuff for you to catch up and play our game. Uh, thank you very much for your patronage and, uh, Let's go. Epic Seven has made the new player experience very, very, very friendly. The human Pokedex, thank you for the uh, thank you for the follow. Um, a lot of games, as they age, get exponentially more generous. Now, here's another thing with the uh with the anniver with not the anniversary but new year's right look at all these other games this is first started off as a pity now this is going to be me ranting this is people going to go to like g uh r grand order and they're gonna be like why did shotgun shogun come back to epic or to fgo i wish that he would have just stayed away i i don't care i hey guys rent free um uh, but how has nobody thrown a huge fit about you having to pay for a random GSSR? It's not even a, it's not even a spark, bro. It is not even a pick ticket. It's not a spark. It's not a pick ticket. If you have 90% of the people in that one thing that you're rolling for, get wrecked. It's going to be a Vlad no matter what you go for. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It's going to be Vlad. You go for extra servants. It's going to be Vlad. You go for arts servants. It's going to be Vlad. Well, it's because Vlad's an art arts berserker, um, a pick ticket. Yeah. A lot of gotcha games, you pay 30 bucks and they just go, cool, dude, which one do you want? Like what, what one of these do you thank you for your $30? Just pick whichever one you which, pick which one ever you want you want. Vlad isn't that bad. I think Genshin, uh, Ganesha is worst. I don't even know anything about that one. That is after my time, baby. Um, but people, again, going back to the, the main premise of this video that I went and ranted off on, uh, people who think 330 pulls, uh, 300 pulls is, uh, is a good um is a good pity system are huffing ridiculous amounts of copium and they are so far down the sunk cost ladder 
Did they just be like, bro, no, yeah, man, this is this is good. Hi, chat, how long would you have to save up in Fate Grand Order to get 900 Saint Courts? How many? How long? A year? A year and a half? 900 Saint Courts? About a year or two? Imagine just sitting there for a year or two being like, bruh. Bro, man, five months, give or take. It's a big, I mean, even five months. I'm up to 450 since the start of Skahath. How long is that? How long was that? Also, still, imagine having to wait a half a year, six months. Just sitting there like, man, can't wait. Can't wait. Oh, it's coming, bro. It's coming, bro. Say for six months and I got 657 tickets and 106, uh, 100, 657 courts and 106 tickets. Okay. Two months ago. How did you get, how did you get 900 or 300 pulls worth in two months without paying? Still. I've been saving since Arjuna. Oh, well, so you've been saving for Arjuna since forever, dude. I mean, if you've been saving for forever, I mean, you definitely didn't get a, a 1100 and, you know, 10 Saint Courts in two months. So six months. So on average, we're talking about six months-ish. That's still ridiculous to save for six months, literally watching everything else go by. You can't roll on anything. You don't even get a free... You guys don't get a free roll every day, right? Like, you guys don't get a free story roll every day, right? Like, is that true? Like, they haven't changed that since, like, I... Yeah, okay. Yeah, so you can't roll anything, dude. You literally can't. Uh, I started a new account, done nothing, collected 300 St. Courts. Well, that's a brand new account. You get a ton of stuff for brand new accounts. Bro, imagine, imagine your game just being like, nah, man, can't even roll story gotcha. Dude, I can't, man. The thing too here is like people who will defend fate grand order and their monetization practices to like the death. Bro, play another game, man. Like just go do something else. Like the more games that you put yourself out there and you play, the more you go back and you look at it and you're like, dude, this, this is hot doo doo. This, this is not good. If you like FGO, that's fine. But as long as you like FGO, but you still understand that their system is hot trash, then that's fine. But if you're going to go to bat and be like, nah, man, Nah, man, this pity system, this pity, this pity system's fine. This pity system's great. You know what? Maybe they have to do this pity system because they only put out a new unit once every uh, once every six months, right? Because all the other units just go to FGO Arcade. They just go to they just go out to FGO Arcade, you know. So you don't really have anything to roll on, except for like once every. Uh, you know, like once every six months. So, you know, you're good. You can just keep up. Now we get a new unit every two months. FGO best gotcha because I'm a masochist. I mean, that's fair. 
I play RTA. I'm sometimes, you know, I feel like a masochist then. FGO Arcade PC port when, dude. That's just what I'm saying, man. Like, I enjoyed FGO Arcade. Yeah. I mean... Yeah. Yeah, if there was a PC port, dude, I'd be all about it, but... Yeah, this, this pity system is... This pity system is massive copium, dude. Just absolutely, absolute massive copium. Yeah.